Wow, it's been a long time since I've done a video, but, um, yeah, I'm back, and, um, just giving you a little heads up, other furries and bronies and whatever, if you're trying to make a fursuit head, or if you're just trying to make a fursuit in general, just a partial is going to cost at least $200 if you're trying to be making a good one, it won't take you like two weeks. It'll take you longer than that. So you can't make it before Halloween, you guys. You gotta realize that it takes time and it takes practice. So lay off the, oh, I gotta go to the store and I gotta do this before Halloween. No, it's gonna take you longer than that. So get it through your thick head. I'm not trying to be mean to you or anything, but you gotta realize that if you want a fursuit, you gotta put time and effort into it. Fur itself costs at least fifty dollars. Like if you're going to buy a few yards on there, like say you only need one color. Well, uh, two yards of like red fur, for example, on fabric.com is going to cost about twenty-five dollars a yard. And for the shipping, it's going to cost a little bit more. So you're going to end up spending about $50 on just fur. And you're not going to have enough. If you just have $50, you're not going to have enough for the rest of your stuff. So if you want uh, paw pads on your hand paws, that's going to cost a little bit more because you need stuffing. You need maybe silicone if you want silicone paw pads uh, or you just want material paw pads so you gotta buy fleece or some other material that you want to make it out of and claws are going to be made of clay or like a plastic material you can get them on like owl crafts or something but the clay ones Sculpey clay costs like seven dollars for a little thing like that big so it's not gonna cost as cheap as you think it is unless you use cardboard and cheap Joann's craft store fur that's like ten bucks a yard, but I mean, that stuff is really, really horrible. So, I wouldn't recommend that. Uh, yeah, and uh, the upholstery foam. Yeah, Joann's, you're not gonna find cheap stuff. A yard of that green foam is about, mm, 15 to 20 dollars per yard when at Walmart you can get it for about 16 to 17 dollars plus tax for a whole freaking roll of it so I recommend going to Walmart in the first place and um, yeah that's where you get the foam don't use a balaclava for your first try I wouldn't recommend it because my first fursuit in the first place. It's on my YouTube channel somewhere. Should be. I can uh, link it in the description if you guys would like. Just give me a little heads up. Otherwise you can find it yourself. But I use an all foam base. That's all you need. For the eyes, I just got done with a, a critique for this person on DeviantArt because they didn't know what they were doing. They were using plastic flower pots for the eyes. That is ridiculous. Why can't you spend an extra five dollars to go get sheets of like foamy stuff at Walmart which I can also link to what it looks like. It's like those little um if you ever when you were a kid you had those little foam letter stickers that come in those big plastic barrel things. I don't know, it, they do it at preschools and stuff, they had those. I mean I did when I was a kid. So um yeah, that's basically it. And uh yeah, I'm going to be working on a few new fursuits myself, like uh, I'm working on Murphy right now, 2.0, the second one, and um, I'm going to link my DeviantArt and my Fur Affinity on the description, so if you want to get your own suit, you can, if you want, I mean, I'm not going to charge you that much as normal fursuiters would, because they would charge you like $900 for a partial, which I think is ridiculous, you don't need that much money to make a partial. So, yeah. And then I'm going to be making my Tesla Cardinal fursuit, which I'm trying to work on getting a tutorial from a friend of mine on how to do the beak. But, um, yeah. 
if you want your own fursuit, like I said, just go to my fur affinity, send me a note, or go on DeviantArt and send me a note, or you can just message me on YouTube here, and I'll most likely respond to it within a couple days, or you can just email me at greenfoxfursuits at gmail.com, and, um, yeah, that's basically it, so, have a good Halloween, maybe I'll post a video before then, but yeah, to the loop.